Welcome to my video, guys. So we are at George's house. Yes, we are. Oh, um, oh. I'm not a very good co-host. <laughs> Grownish episode. I don't know. With Aaron's door newly opened, it made way for the biggest. This is your time to uplift what you've done, not drag it down. As much as I believe in telekinesis, he is so fine. I, I want this yeah, hairstyle, I but I don't think it would suit my head shape. Okay, and I really want a boyfriend with dreads because I'm anymore. getting dreads, but not like real dreads, okay. like butterfly Since looks, right but like that's gonna be my staple hairstyle from now on. Honest, has a good point, you know. Huh? You're lying. And after all of these years, I, uh. Well, this is a great friend. Hmm. They say when one door closes, another opens. I love Zoe's but monologues. When you close a will oh, look at his cat picture. You just have to have the courage to go through it. Oh my gosh, it's me. You know the words. Come on, sing it. Oh. <laughs> I'm glad they put this in, because what the fuck? This episode was so good. The last three episodes have been, like, so mid- I was never a fan of Zoe and Aaron. I was thinking, well, Zoe's gonna be sulking the whole season. Like, I'm, I'm, like, I get it, it's fine, yeah. But damn, like, both of us single, I can, I can hold it down for the both of us. You know what I mean? There's no need for both of us to be single. At least one of us have joy, and here Zoe is. That's adorable. Oh my gosh! I don't even want to go through like what happened like in my mind it's like they kissed that's the end of the show that's the end of the episode oh i have to run for it basically like everyone's plot lines we find out vivek got fired from his job because he decided to tell the truth and no one was forcing him to no one was forcing him to he just told the truth and then he lost his job and from losing his job he's now a uber driver and we found out because anna and um naomi ended up booking him as their uber so yeah that was one thing another thing was aaron i really thought this whole episode was going to be about aaron which it mainly was but it was very much overshadowed but i'm not gonna lie like his plot line was good as well so i really enjoyed that so he was gonna do a speech he practiced the speech they said oh the speech is too negative it wasn't negative it was realistic like what the fuck like if if my reality is poor because of racism am i just supposed to pretend like my reality is invalid like it doesn't it, it doesn't matter that's so dumb but yeah so he decides okay cool um i'm still gonna do the speech but they want me to change it make it more positive so he thinks about it for a while and then he decides to get luca's little sister to do the speech on his behalf and obviously she can't get in trouble because she's a student speaking her truth in it so at the end of the day it goes well gets positive response but at the end of the episode aaron's like yeah like i don't want to continue this university he said i don't want to be a grad student at this university anymore meaning i'm gonna have to quit being a ta and then they him and um the teacher the guy from um blackish he was like oh like this is sad because i'm losing a friend you know what i mean and that was such a moment like i didn't cry or anything because it wasn't that deep but i felt it you know when you feel a little bit of mm, in your chest that's how i felt i was like oh that's a, that's sad man like you guys are really cool then the other storyline was basically zoe and luca um zoe agreed to oh yeah we're gonna have a line out in three days three days we can do it duh. you know i don't know anything about fashion like that but i know it's not three days to make a whole line that is so much effort by the end of it they only end up with three pieces the pieces were good but it was like it's free in it you can't really say this is a line um you need way more time and then zoe's apologizing and then he luca's trying to cheer her up like oh no like 
quality over quantity like these these pieces are fire then he puts one on her and then they start staring at each other and then i paused my thing because i was like like you know when it's like i'm not uncomfortable but you know when it's like nerves like because if i didn't want them to be together it would be a thing of i'll just watch it but because i i do like them together it was like like you know <laughs> oh my gosh and then i unpaused it and they kissed and i was just like And I was just so happy for them. Because honestly, that's what I want for me. Like, Luca is so fine. Damn. Oh, I broke out my forehead because it's my time of the month. Not the best. But yeah, that's the end of it. I should do these reviews lying down more often. This is enjoyable. Oh my god. The You're going to have to cut this That's the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, comment. <laughs> I always forget to say that.